the approval by the FDA of the first PCSK9 inhibitor is a major event in cardiovascular medicine. It really does herald a new era of powerful cholesterol-lowering agents. The PCSK9 inhibitors, as I think many of you know, are capable of lowering LDL cholesterol by at least 50% and in some cases 70%. And that benefit is additive with the statin drugs. Uh, people that we've never been able to treat before with heterozygous familial hyperlipidemia, often starting with LDL levels of over 200, can really get to very desirable levels of LDL cholesterol with the combination of statins and PCSK9 inhibitors. Their approval is as an add-on to statins, not as a replacement for statins. The FDA was careful in choosing the language in the label because they believe that with all of the great outcome data with statins, PCSK9 inhibitors should not be given without a statin uh, since the, the outcome data for PCSK9 inhibitors is not yet available and will not be available until current clinical outcome trials complete, probably in 2017.